What's on your mind as you turn 40 this year? It weighed heavily on me a few months ago for quite a while. I thought, oh, woe is me. I haven't done this. I haven't done that. Um, you know, I need to do things differently in my life. I need to continue to lose weight. I need to continue to work harder at things. Sure, whatever. I need to continue to do all that stuff. And I can. It's not the end of my life. Somehow or another, it just snapped into me. I admit, I talked to a few of my older, you know, advisor, consigliere people that I talked to. And I sat there and I'm just telling them I'm going to turn 40. And they're in their, you know, late 60s, early 70s, mid 70s. And they're like, so? It's just <laughs> another birthday. You're going to have 30 or 40 more, you know? Uh, so um, I started thinking, you're, you're absolutely right. Maybe it is a time to reflect on what you've done and what you want to do, but it's not a time to regret anything. Uh, for me, I'm happy I went to Ireland. I'm happy I did that. I'm happy I did that before I, went, before I turned 40. Uh, and that probably helped make such a huge difference because had I not done that, that regret probably would have been weighing pretty heavily on me. But now the, the door is open. I have all kinds of things that I can do for the next 30 or 40 years. You know, I can start planning my new international trips or, uh, you know, am I going to take a year off of life when I turn 60, you know, and go do something really neat like hike, you know, uh, the, the, the Horn of Africa or something like that. You know, I want to do crazy stuff and have fun, but um, it doesn't weigh heavily on me anymore. Now I look forward to having a really fun party.